Hello boys and girls, it's Marcy Chevalis and it's story time. Today's story is called Rap-A-Tap-Tap. -tap. Here's Bojangles, Think of That by Leo and Diane Dillon. This is a story about a famous dancer called Bojangles. This book is a Coretta Scott King honor book right here. And it's a really fun book that's gonna teach us about a famous black American. Are you ready to hear more about him? All right, let's grow. For all you AR readers, this is a level 1.9 book worth half a point, And it is quiz number 63504. There once was a man who danced in the street. Rap a tap tap, think of that. He brought pleasure and joy to the people he'd greet. Rap a tap tap, think of that. He didn't just dance, he made art with his feet. Rap a tap tap, think of that. That's really cool boys and girls. I've never thought of dancing as making art with your feet. Did you ever think of dancing as art with your feet? Seems like Bojangles was doing just that in the creative way he moved his body. And it's really cool also that he was dancing throughout the streets of the city so that everyone could see his talents. Let's read more about Mr. Bojangles. He, passed, he danced past doors. Some were open, some closed. Rap a tap tap, think of that. So some people welcomed Mr. Bojangles at that time and some people did not because of the unfair rules and laws at the time. But I bet those that welcomed him really were blessed by his cool talents. He danced past folks in fancy clothes. Rap a tap tap, think of that. He danced through a pay place people called the skids. Rap a tap tap, think of that. It looks like he's dancing for everyone, for people who have lots of money and who don't have very much. He danced through crowds of laughing kids. Rap a tap tap, think of that. His feet fairly flew as he tipped his hat. Rap a tap tap, think of that. He briefly paused to pat an old cat. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. He danced rain or shine in all kinds of weather. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. Seems like he's very passionate about his dancing. Are you passionate about the thing that you love to do the most? I hope you are. Usually those passions turn into something special as you grow up. People listened each day for his toe tapping clatter. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. He danced many rhythms that were seldom the same. Rap a tap tap. Think of that. Now I'm starting to think, why does this book keep on saying rap a tap tap? Hmm. It's talking about dancing and see his feet moving. I wonder if he's a tap dancer. Maybe that's why it keeps saying rap a tap tap. I wonder how many out there who are listening to the story also are tap dancers too. Dance was his passion and it brought him fame. Rap a tap tap, think of that. Bojangles, Bojangles, that was his name. Rap a tap tap, think of that. Let's learn a little bit more about Bojangles. Bill Bojangles Robinson, who was born in 1878 and died in 1949, is known as the greatest tap dancer of all time. Hey, I was right when I heard the words rap a tap tap and was wondering, hmm, why is it saying that? I was right when I predicted it was because he was a tap dancer. His fame has reached mythic proportions. He had charm and charisma, and it was said he talked with his feet. His rhythms were so intricate and fast, it was impossible for other dancers to repeat some of them. That's amazing, boys and girls. During the Great Depression of the 1930s, Bill Robinson was the highest paid black entertainer. He shared his wealth with less fortunate friends and neighbors through those hard times. Man, he had a generous spirit and that's wonderful to hear. Bill Robinson performed shows on Broadway as well as in famous clubs around the country. 
He performed reviews that appeared in vaudeville and he danced in several films, including four with the child star Shirley Temple, who was very famous at that time. On May 25th, 1989, Congress declared that day, which was his birthday, as National Tap Dance Day in Bill Robinson's honor. Wow, that was so cool to learn about Bill Bojangles Robinson. I hope you enjoyed listening to that story. If you did, go ahead and click the like button right now. And if you want to hear more stories like this, please click the subscribe button down below. Until next time, see you later, friends. Goodbye.